You are watching ABC 7 News at 530. Well, a big step forward for a culinary icon here on the Sun Coast. For decades, people have enjoyed eating at the Columbia Restaurant on St. Armand Circle in a building that they've always rented. But it's now a building they can happily call their own. ABC 7's Francesca Constantini joins us live from St. Armand Circle with more details of this purchase. Francesca? Jacqueline, the owners of the 60-year-old restaurant told me that they're finally fulfilling their lifelong dream and they can actually provide more access to the people who come to the restaurant. This was a dream that my dad had and I'm proud to be able to make it happen. A dream the Gonsmart family shared for generations. This building, this city is so important to our family. Richard Gonsmart is the president and fourth generation family member of the Columbia restaurant. And for 60 years, the restaurant has been a staple in St. Armand Circle. This location, known for its Spanish menu, attracts dozens of locals and visitors daily. And it's yummy. And now, after all these years, its owners can finally call this building their own. It'll provide a better experience for the guests visiting and the Locals dining. Last week, its owners were able to purchase the property and they're already planning on some changes. This includes upgrading the kitchen and improving the rear of the restaurant, where traffic has increased because of the new parking garage. A totally different view from when the restaurant opened its doors locally back in 1959. Before anybody discovered there weren't all these shops. There was a gasoline station across the street. This making Gonsmart's grandfather initially question the location of the restaurant. But fast forward to now, Gonsmart says he's glad his grandfather didn't move so he can continue bringing his family's dishes and history to the community. Uh, satisfaction to make sure that the recipe uh, stays the same. I mean, we got to make sure that they're constant. And most importantly, fulfilling the American dream. The future generations because it's uh, it's promoting and remembering where we came from. That we came with nothing, but we worked hard and to provide others opportunity. To Now, the family actually had the opportunity to buy this building back in 1960, but they were not able to at that time. Now that they own it, they are planning on having more changes. Live in St. Armand's Key, Francesca Constantini, ABC7, your Suncoast News.